My name is Daniel Holmes and I'm an artist with Hova. One of my favorite things to do has been uh, using string art, string pull um, type of art style and allow the work to, to form its own patterns. Also, I like to do uh, time period uh, senses of the 1600s, 1700s. I'm more into the uh, history of art. I'm very particular about what my pieces are and what they represent. I put myself a little bit in each one of the pieces I do. It's what you're feeling inside is how you paint. And hopefully the connection between you and your people that buy your paintings can feel that emotion coming through. I want something that's gonna mean something. Emily and Nicole both said, you know, if you're gonna do something, don't just do it. Make sure it's your best piece. Each piece you do, make sure it's your best piece. My medical and my mental issues I've dealt with from a past experiences of things that have happened to me. And I deal with it every day, you know, it's like a one day at a time. Some of my artwork expresses that, some of it doesn't. I've been homeless off and on for several years. And like I said, you know, it's it's not easy. I actually have an apartment. I just took a chance. I walked up to the landlord and I said, look, can you help me? I said, this is what I'm working with and this is what I have. And he said, yeah, he said, we'll work with you. It was wonderful, you know, but we always remember one thing. We're always one step away from being homeless. We're never off of that list. There's a lot of things that you wish to express to people about homelessness and about how you feel. The losses that you see along the way. And you know, people, they, they can sense it in the sense that, you know, in their art, they can see that, you know, that you have seen a lot of emotional trials and tribulations and through POVA, through what we're doing here, is that we're learning to um, express ourselves in a more positive sense because we need to see that we can work through our difficulties and bring ourselves back into what would be called the norm of society. We are not just artists, individual, we are a family of artists. You know, we go back out into the community and we help others. And we've learned that through here because we've been told, you know, you matter, you count. And that's what is told to us every day. It's important that you keep your sense of caring and understanding even when everything is going down. You know, hope, hope and faith are something, you know, are, you know, they're not lost, they're just dormant for a bit until you need them, until they appear. And they do. But that's what homelessness is all about. It's, it's, it's just a learning of who you are and how you can survive that day. And being homeless, you know, the one thing that we want to bring across to people is that we are human.